Okay, hello everybody and welcome back to Mass Effect 2 where today I am gonna piece together something about the derelict reaper Hopefully if I have the time It's gonna be like an hour and a half. I can't change the difficulty because I'm trying to get the hardcore achievement thing and uh, Actually, I don't think there is one but I'm playing through on hard anyway. I'm gonna give myself an achievement for it <laughs> um, But I'm not gonna change the difficulty so I have to go in and play it again, but I'm gonna piece together something just so it's not like this weird, like, abrupt jump to, like, what happens directly after it, so. We'll get, we'll, we'll get started on the Derelict Reaper. And, let's see, are they? No, I'm good. What am I doing? I don't know. I'm tired. I've, I've got one of my sisters. I'm like, please, please go get me a caffeinated beverage or I'm going to die. I'm going to die. Where do we want to go? Why would we be IFF in... In this one? I think so. Is it, it's not in the Omega Nebula. Because that's where the freaking Omega 4, whatever. Is is that itself? Acquire Revive in the Thorn Nebula, Thorn System. Yes, that's right, Schwarzschild. I need a cabinated beverage. Nemozi Nene. Minor gra gravitic anomaly in the northern hemisphere. Yep, I remember because we were like, well, if they had studied this, they would have found a reaper and or died. <laughs> and then the derelict reaper itself. Oh my gosh, it's still. Whew. Oh my gosh. How does it not. Like how does how did you not find that? <laughs> Melee creatures have to dry off like you. <coughs> or do we encounter melee creatures? Oh, <coughs> I guess those big two chonka bugs, the big the ones that spit fire at you, and the and the dogs. I guess too, they just charge straight at you. You know, I'm glad they don't dodge, but still, it makes more sense for them to dodge after you've hit them with a couple of bullets, you know, instead of for them to keep coming. Whew, dream team, let's go. My yin and yang. My balance keepers. Alright, we are going. And I'm gonna be bringing... See, and it's not just that when I do collector missions, I'm like, oh, I need... I'm gonna use the collector particle beam. Or, you know, if I'm if the Reapers are the Collectors, I... When I'm gonna be fighting Reaper creatures, I want something that's a more direct... Like... Like, I can stare right at them and take it down... Quickly. Whereas a missile launcher, I can just fire, but it'll hit... Anything. And for humans and, like, mechs and stuff, it's pretty easy. But anything bigger than that, or tougher than that... Is a little bit... It's a little bit scatterbrained, and so it's not as effective in a lot of ways. And you use a lot of stuff, like a lot of missiles, to get rid of them. Whereas this can, like, burn through, like, a husk super quick, too. And the arc projector is just good if you're gonna encounter a bunch of mechs, and it'll just get them all at once for you. So, it does have its different... I don't just pick it because it's a collector thing. I pick it because I find it easier to use and more direct for the situation. Everybody in the club getting tipsy. Yep, that's good. This is good. <laughs> What's with all the chop, Joker? Doing my best. <laughs> the wind's gusting to 500 kph. Does this 
second ship alongside the Reaper. It's not transmitting any IFF, but the Ladar paints its silhouette as Geth. I guess we know where the science team stopped reporting in. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised the Geth didn't find this first. What just happened? The Reaper's Mass Effect fields are still active. We just passed inside their envelope. Because we were passing pretty close to the planet, so it was like... Huh? <laughs> oh man, we just... Wow, we didn't... I kind of wish you could walk in, like, you know, and be like, Okay, here we are, guys, let's go, you know, but it kind of throws you out. <laughs> just kind of throws you out into it, but... Alright, well, I'll, I'll see you guys if something cool happens, I guess. But now we're here, we're gonna keep going. Nobody died. That was nice. This is valuable. Nice. We already have all the heavy skin weave, though, so... That's funny. I knew we got one while we were here, though. Good to see that. I was right. Cutscene. Those bullets whiz by. And we can see him, we know what he is. He is most definitely a gay. Why not stay? The Geth was the cyber. I thought Geth didn't speak. I have never heard of a Geth acting alone. Yeah. Interesting, it's like Thane that points it out, like the you know, the Geth was the sniper. Enemies are Because he's a sniper, he knows. Whoa! Whoa, I can't believe I got out of that one. I got my caffeinated beverage, by the way. All my weapons had cryo ammo on, and oh my gosh. Ow! Me. All we need to do now is destroy the Mass Effect. Then the ship falls into the planet. Well, you know. 
I have a pretty cheery crew. We'll try. I haven't died once yet, guys. Of course I haven't, right? You're supposed to have a 24 capacity on this. Here we go, guys. For the second time around, we go and grab this. We go and grab it. That is our objective. So the Cerberus team did recover it. But where are they now? We've been fighting them, Thane. We've been fighting them. <laughs> Perfect. I'm running out of ammo already. Oh, what? What? Nothing's happening. Uh-oh. 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 The Reaper core is acting like it's still open. It's not, though, obviously. First time I've had this problem. I guess we'll reload. That was interesting. Has it any if any of you ever had that problem? I haven't died once. Thane's died a couple times. An easy shot. An easy shot. Nice. Okay, okay, there it goes. Alright. Alright, are we good? Wow, they both died. Wow, this is not going as well this time. Ah! <laughs> oh, come on. Okay, good. Don't you dare mess up on me. I'm on Kira reveals them. I'm on Kira reveals them. That's nice, that's good. Holy goodness! Perfect! Whew! Oh, my, my trigger fingers hurt. Tally said no one's ever captured a Geth intact. It is a significant risk, but not our first. Yeah. We're out of time. Let's <laughs> move. I like that it's Thane, like it just happens to be Thane that we're talking to instead of Samara there, but I like that. By the way, we have a package, uh, don't worry about it. Woo! <laughs> clear, go! Oh, it took us an hour. A little less than an hour, actually. It was like 50 minutes to go through all that noise. Which is a great idea to store a freaking Geth in an AI core! And in it just happened to conveniently field repair where I landed and died? I've killed hundreds of these Thousands, Shepard. I still think our best interests involve an airlock. I wanna talk to it. That's what we did with Grunt, too. They're like, don't open it, and I was like, eh. There's no guarantee we can- Tally's gonna freak when she hears about this. So what about this Reaper IFF? Linking it with the Normandy system- Yeah, it does! ...poses certain risks. Uh, hey, okay, so we can go around. We can get these upgrades. We're gonna need to get the upgrades. Um, and we're gonna need to talk to everybody before we do anything. Yep, and then shotgun damage. Excellent. Scram pulsar. 
Oh, and, yes. Oh, wait. Oh, shoot. I did not. Whoa, wait, really? Oh, crap. I forgot. Oh, no, no. No, no, no. That's, we're fine. We're fine on that. There's six. Oh. All right, then. Well. Okay. We need platinum. All right. Well, look at that. That's cool. Okay, let's save really quick. Yeah, look. Okay, let's see when we started it. We started it. Well, actually, no, never mind. We could probably maybe see it on the load. We started it at 57.21. And... You know, give her, you know, plus or minus a few minutes from being in here. From being back on the ship. Fifty-eight thirteen. Yeah! Heh heh heh. Eh eh eh. It's like fifty minutes, so it's like our record. I didn't even I didn't even change the difficulty. Right? Okay. Hardcore! Hardcore! It ends. Who's who's got an update? Indoctrination! <laughs> Reaper indoctrination is an insidious means of corrupting organic minds, reprogramming the brain through physical and psychological conditioning, using electromagnetic fields, infrasonic and ultrasonic noise, and other subliminal methods. I wonder, methods. well, no. The I was thinking it's like it, it, it affects them to make them look at it with superstitious awe, but it's like, I wonder if people would do that anyway, you know, without being influenced. Maybe some would, but obviously, you know, us and the crew, like... We, I think I think it's only it's, it's good to have a healthy respect for even a fearful respect. It's okay to be afraid, but just don't let that control you. We're right there, side of the Okay, Morden. Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Actually, wanted to talk. Medical matters. Aware that mission is oh, dangerous. Oh, he does it before. Different species react differently <laughs> to stress. Yeah. Sexual activity normal as stress release still. Recommend caution with Thane. Drell human liaisons <laughs> complex. Thane complex as well. You have a recommendation as a doctor? <laughs> Prolonged human to Drell skin contact can cause small rash That's not itching. Okay. Oral contact may cause mild hallucination. That's fine. <laughs> also forwarding advice booklet to your quarters. Valuable diagrams, positions comfortable for both species, erogenous oh, zone man. overviews. Can supply oils or ointments to reduce discomfort. Gave ED electronic relationship hey, that, the oils and ointments might necessary. be helpful, though. You know what I mean? Like, if you get a rash, like, that'd be nice. <laughs> oh, but I wonder, though, because I think somebody mentioned when we did this last time that they didn't get this talk with Morden, and I'm like, I wonder if it only happens with, eight, does it happen with human to human or human to Asari? Even though you couldn't, because you're not, you can you can reinitiate a romance with Liara if you have the Shadow Broker, or even if, I think if you see her, but she, nothing happens, I don't think. I don't know, but... Wait a minute, Morden, you're just yanking me around, aren't you? <laughs> Shocking suggestion. Doctor-patient confidentiality, a sacred trust, would never dream of mockery. Of mockery. Enjoy yourself while possible, Shepard. We'll be here studying cell reproduction. Much simpler, less alcohol and mood music required. <laughs> Yay! All right, so we got that. And we'll stop in and say hi to Jacob. Make sure Jacob's all right. Commander, can I help you with something? I'm more interested in just talking for a bit. I'm good, Shepard. All right, we're good. Ready for anything? We live. We'll get loud and spill some drinks on the Citadel. We'll talk later. Commander. Commander. All right, let's go poke Joker. While we're on the floor. Joker, I'm coming! Commander. I assume everything's going well up here? Good for now. Okay. Fractured my thumb on the mute. That's it for now. See you, Wait. The crew is still working ah! to get the Reaper IFF installed, Shepard. It is more complicated than I first anticipated. I will alert you once the system is ready for shakedown. Is there anything else I can do for you? 
Uh, I guess... Uh, no, I don't think any... I guess nothing changes, probably. I want to know more about you. Do you have a specific inquiry? You and Joker, your job, your name, your location... Your location! Where are you? My core intelligence is housed in a quantum blue box located behind That's the... That's all for now. Logging you out, Shepard. Has he ever said anything about Samara? Commander, what do you think about the people we're picking up? Well, about the ones you went out with last. Samara feels like she could shoot me in a very tranquil <laughs> way, which does not make me feel any better about it. <laughs> and Thane seems like the strong, sensitive, murdering type. You know, those are always great to have around, a real cuddler. A it's cuddler? just my opinion, though. There's really no need I to I wonder if he says that. Does he say that? That's it I for think now. he does say that with the See male you, shepherd. And even if you're not romancing Thane, that's like as soon as he comes on the ship, that's what he says about Thane. All right, we're gonna do the the walk around, just real quick. Oh, let's uh, let's talk to Kelly really quick. We have a guest down in the air. <laughs> it makes me a little uneasy. <laughs> I hope you don't activate him. But you would know best. Is there anything I should know? You have unread messages at your private terminal. Anything else, Commander? Oh, okay, bye. That'll be all. I'll be here if you need I actually, uh... The IFF is nearly installed, Shepard. Okay! However, I must test its impact on the Normandy systems. I suggest you take a shuttle to access your next location. Oh, she's saying that because I'm next to here. Okay. Unread messages, encrypted transmission. Oh. Oh, no. Okay, I see. Ever you need all the necessary protocols. Keep the Omega-4 relay. If you believe it can be trusted, make sure ED is adequately protected. After we just finished Overlord, too, with the get whole get thing. Uh, oh, yes. It would take her over a year. This is from Cerberus Command. Darn glad to have you with this, Shepard. Alright. My fish should be safe because I haven't gone into my quarters since I bought them, and that usually. Usually that means they're not, they, they sort of aren't active yet, but I think it's maybe about two or three missions before they die. Ah, oh, fishers! Hello! You're so pretty. You're so pretty. Oh, you guys want to, uh, oh, also, Prague, I always forget now that you're here. Wow. Okay, um, I'm only missing, yep, yeah, the, I'm only missing four, I think. Survive all five waves, uh, get all six Cerberus packets, the Insanity one, obviously, and the 20 different targets, which I've got nine, that's cool. That's a much more difficult than I expected, even as a biotic. Yeah, so there's no hard one, which is kind of lame, I think, but I will make my own. Let's see, what is it? What, what do they look like? Uh, insanity. This is just to... Oh, where's the one where you're like... Complete it. You complete it with that. You get a little star. You look completely different! I don't know. I'll make one. And I'll show you guys. Fishies! All right, let's go talk to everybody. I don't know. I might have been able to talk to Thornton, uh, Thornton uh, Morden about other things besides Thane. I <laughs> just combined their names. Buy a pet. I kind of want to play, I've been thinking more and more that I want to play Mass Effect 3 with this save file. Technically, though, if I'm going to keep true, this one, keep true to my original Mass Effect 3 walkthrough, as, you know, as a, as true as I can, one of the big things was that Morden actually died. I kept Morden alive the first time with my mail ship, but second time with this one, I don't know what I did. I thought I did the exact same thing, but I did not, I guess, and I lost Morden. Which I actually really liked, um, oh, what's his name? Paddock Wicks. I liked him. He, his replacement, Morden's replacement. I liked him a lot. So that's kind of hard. It's like, oh, like of all of them, I think he's like the cool, like the coolest replacement, you know? Like Rex is, or Rex, uh, I don't know about Grant's replacement, I don't know. Do 
you need something. Have a few minutes to talk? You needn't ask. Time for me is short, Siha. But any I have is yours to take. How are you feeling? No worse than ever. You needn't worry. And you? You are well? No need to worry about me. I'm fine. How are fine. you holding Perfectly up? Fine. Perfectly fine. I'm looking forward to the end of the mission. It has been many years since I felt I could relax anywhere. I spent two years dead. Every moment seems irreplaceable now. I spent ten years dead. I understand the feeling. Strange that I should only reawaken now, when there is so little time left. It's almost like, you know, is it worse or better, you know, to like, maybe just die in his sort of like, you know, like a super stasis or whatever, you know, like kind of like the death thing he's talking about, or reawaken and maybe feel more, but it's like, I don't know, do you die more peaceful or more aware? Like, it's just kind of, either way, it kind of sucks, you know? People are talking out there, and I hear it all. I'm bummed, Kasumi. I have to say, that Jacob, mm, he seems pretty intense. I wonder if he likes Japanese girls with a pension for kleptomania. I liked Kasumi. Joker and Edie are like an old I married couple. I like taking Kasumi and Thay now. I keep expecting to walk in on them bickering about the temperature in the cockpit. Edie has a wicked sense of humor. Or I should say, a really funny lack of one. Sometimes she seems like a person. But when it comes down to it, I can't get past her being a computer. Mm hmm Come back later. I'm sure I'll have more to talk about. We can't... When we poke your things, it's the same thing, right? Road. Yeah. That used to be my calling card when I first started out. In place of whatever I took, I left a single red rose. It wasn't until I met Keiji that I realized how silly it was. He had a way of making you realize when you were just being sentimental. Nothing wrong with being sentimental. Everybody good in here? You good? Alright. Baby's doing okay. Well, you know, this baby and, and your baby. Okay, guys, that's what I came in here for. Shepard, I thought we could chat a bit. I would like that. I think her window's a bigger. To me. Oh, bye. I won't bore. No, no, no. That means a lot to me. It if does. If both still live when this is done, you may call upon me for. This was intense for me. I will come for you, Shepard. I don't know. It's just, you know, she's a Justicar. Her word is, is her law. You know. Uh, let's maybe see what her thoughts on the mission progress are. Shepard, how do you think our mission is going? Spirits are high. We have a strong team and everyone is committed. How are you? <laughs> Perhaps we can how speak How are later. you? I wish to meditate. I mean, I should go. The one before, of like, course. you know, it's, it's really short and simple, but it... She's like, I will come for you. It's like, you know, she hasn't had a friend in centuries you know someone she could talk to and so that that's a big deal commander what can i do for you do you have a minute miranda there's a lot to do shepherd okay maybe another time uh wait let's check the normandy steps anything i should know regarding the normandy the crew's working well and the ship appears to be performing to specifications i'll let you work of course, Commander. I was wondering if there was like a because we don't have. I don't think the med bay upgrade actually affects anything, but I could be wrong. How can I help you, Commander? Again? Do you have everything you need? Absolutely. Since you set up my kitchen with proper supplies, I won't take any more of your time. Back to work. Back to work. Let's check in on Chakwas. I wish hers changed a little bit every so often. She basically doesn't do anything. Oh, yeah, then I gotta go. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, we'll talk to Chakwas in a second. <laughs> I'll go talk to everybody else first, but 
I'm like, hey, Chuck was, I stuck a big gif in the, in the AI bay. You don't mind, do you? You don't mind? Tally's gonna be so mad, though. Garrus. Garrus, you gotta come with me. Have you got a minute? Sure, just killing time anyway. Optimizing weapons charge. Okay. I'm still trying to figure out how to prepare for this we mission. We could ease stress Humans together. Humans don't deal with stress the way Turians do. Uh... Do you ever regret leaving CSAC or the Not for a minute. When it comes down to it, Shepard, I don't think... When a good Turian hears a battle, I just don't see the point in staying quiet and polite. Not when the galaxy is at stake. I've had too much effect Thanks on him. Thanks for the talk, Garrus. I I'll do that. Later. That Cerberus entry sure actually makes me kind of sad. And I think I said it when I was reading it, but... Where it says Garrus will never fully develop his abilities if he's constantly in Shepard's shadow. Because Garrus... I feel like if you died, Garrus could take over. Like, and he obviously did his own thing while you were gone. Like, while you were dead, you know? Like, he didn't just give up. Nobody just gave up, you know? But... Let's go talk to Tally. Is it in this one or Mass Effect 3 where um, my two engineers can get together and like make out and be, be in a finally be in a relationship? I'm not sure. I feel like last time though they had they had a ton of funny quips and I feel like I didn't get many of them this time. Like, we didn't get many, and maybe I just went through it fast. Maybe I just went really fast last time, you know? So, let's see. Let's see if anything's changed. What can we do for you, Commander? What can we do for you, Commander? Commander. Commander. I got my, uh, my family's, uh, last name done, and apparently we're, we're pretty heavily Scottish. Like, you do, like, the family crest thing. Although, we had, like, several entries for our last name. Uh, for my, like, my dad's last name, I guess, basically. And, uh, I did my mom's, too, her maiden name. But, hers is Carry more on. Irish. Will do, Commander. And my dad's is more Scottish. Shepard, what can I do for Are you? Are you mad at me? Have you got time to talk? I really need to clean oh, up come this on. Entry. Maybe later? Let's see. How's the Normandy running? Say what you will about... Okay. I don't know if it comes uh, back to a collector attack, though. No. I'll I'm let really you work. Talk to you later. Oh, that's Edie. Whoa, whoa, whoa. She's a lady. She looks sort of ominous. Like, you could say... Like, you could say she's sort of ominous with, like, the red glowing or whatever, but I don't know. I think she's beautiful. Just looks like she's alive, you know? Red isn't necessarily bad. Jack, what you thinking about? Hey. What's happening? You got a lot of questions, don't you? Uh... Yeah, Samara and Jack, I think, were, 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 were towards the end of their official conversation. Shepard looks so freaking intimidating. I miss your friendly nature when I'm not around. <laughs> Been thinking. We've seen a lot of shit together now. And you're always coming to talk Do to me. Do not take this weird. It's just... I'm not really a girl's <sighs> person. I like you, all right? That's a good place to stop. Okay. I did think that was kind of... Str the first time that happened, I was just like... I was like, what? Why are you? Why are you jumping on that all of a sudden? Like Shepard was like so dry, sarcastic. She's like, I miss your shining personality when you're not around. And what is that? I mean, does Jack not notice that I do that to everybody? It's like, but I can. I mean, you know, she's she is of everybody. She's completely different than everybody else. You know, like you have to take that into her into account, big time. Her the upbringing, her life. Her story. She doesn't think like everybody else does, you know, and that's that's fine. So you have to take that into account when talking to her. Uh, people, again, like her whole life, people have been coming to her wanting things, you know, like they want her power, or they want her body, or whatever, you know, which is kind of interesting that she, I honestly thought she was bi. Um, but until somebody in the comments said once that she isn't, she does not, she actually, she, this, isn't, this isn't just putting you off, she's actually, you can't romance her as a female, and I was like, 
that's really weird. I actually can see Jack more with a female shepherd than I can with a male shepherd. And she said before in conversation that she's been with women and men. So I don't know. I mean, maybe it was sort of unwilling with women, I guess. I don't know. But I, which, you know, she says, like, that, that couple, that guy and girl, they got her into bed. And then she killed them. But, it, well, not for that reason, specifically because they were going to betray her. But... And grunt, and then... What's the bucket over there? Soldier Boy. God dang! The freaking rap references from the 90s. Shepard? We good? Uh, mission. Let's see. What are your thoughts about our mission? We'll push our enemies to the edge of space, then step on their fingers <laughs> one at a time until the void takes void them. Void take you. Just checking in. How are you doing? Battlemaster, I have everything. Clan kin and enemies to fight perfect that's all for now shepherd i'm glad grunt and you look really freaking good in that armor okay we're gonna get oh god we're gonna get to the end i just want to play video games forever it's all i want to do i don't want to get ready i don't want to go anywhere anything interesting uh nope doesn't look like it why are you in the trash compact? Oh, hey. Hey, don't touch. That oh. rifle's older than you are. Did we start over? Good, Jesse. That's my okay. lucky charm. All right. All, men have been All right, old man. Uh-huh. <laughs> hey, at least he's got a heart, right? Back for another lesson. Can't say I blame Taylor's pup. A man does what he has to do to survive. Ran up against oh, a Batarian okay. camp, not too different from that one. Job was to erase the whole thing from the map. Men, women, and the man in charge. Learned that day that despots are cowards. You show them you're in charge, not them, and they cry like little girls. So you knew ah. Archangel from before. Yeah, like, move forward. Interesting. Why? Knew a lot of men taking jobs to kill the son of a bitch. I never saw the point. You know, I wanted the same thing. A whole lot of mercs dead. I just elbowed him in the face. Life, oh. And he kept himself alive with all the mercs in Omega after him. That ain't easy. I forgot to poke him more. I should let you go. Oh, okay. Talk more later, Interesting. Shepard. Interesting. You sure? I should let you okay. go. I meant, I, I was poking his, his rifle before, but I forgot to poke him, so... Maybe we'll come back and see if we can get other things from him. Alright, that was... Oh, and now we're gonna go... Talk to... The creature, the Geth, in my AI core. Because that's a really good place for one. I wonder what would have happened if I had started the next mission without talking to the Geth. I already called him by his name. It's Legion. If I had already gone in there. Or if I hadn't gone in there and started the next mission, that would have been kind of interesting. I'll have to look and see if that does. I want to look it up. Or you guys can tell me, because I probably won't have time to look it up today. Chakwaz, how you doing? How may I help you, Commander? All right, never I'll mind. see you later, Doctor. Commander. Just checking up, wondering if you had anything to say about the, the creature I'm keeping in your, practically in your med bay. <laughs> this was such a moment. When you first open this and you're like, <gasps> he's like all lit up over there. Oh man. Edie. Talk to me, Edie. What's this area of the ship? This is the AI core room, where my higher functions are housed. You're not mobile, are you? You can't get out of here? I have minimal access to the ship's systems. Direct landlines allow me to interface with the security monitors and public address system. In combat, I am provided temporary access to the. She doesn't have access to it systems. all the time, then. Okay, we have to be in active combat. Hey, guy. Like, look at it, like you're just like. Ugh. There's like you spend the whole Mass Effect one. Basically, all you're killing is Geth and occasionally Cerberus guys, and. And then there's just one laying in your med, like in your AI core, practically in your med bay. I don't know. 
And he's a, you can see, he has headlights on. He knows what's going on. Ten hut. Ten hut. I'm turning this thing back on. I feel like Be I should ready. have brought my friends Aye. in. Like, hey, Buckos, uh, Tally, how's it going? Oh, shnikey. I have saved. isolated our systems and erected additional firewalls. I am prepared to resist any hacking attempt. I think Edie could take him on. Not working. Wakey, wakey. I see you. I see you moving. <laughs> oh, look, he's got a headache. He's like, oh, did you hear that? Oh. Whatever a digital headache is. Can you understand me? Yes. Uh... Are you going to attack me? No. Uh. Oh, I can't remember what I said last time. You said my name aboard the Reaper. Have we met? We know of you. You mean I've bought a lot of Geth? We have never met. No, you and I haven't. But I've met other Geth. We are all Geth, and we have not met you. You are Shepard, Commander, Alliance, Human. Fought heretics, killed by collectors, rediscovered on the old machine. You seem to know an awful lot about me. Extranet data sources, insecure broadcasts, all organic data sent out is received. We watch you. You watch me or you watch organics? Mm. Yes. Yeah. Which? Both. The old machine. You mean the Reaper? Reaper. A superstitious title originating with the Protheans. We call those entities the old machines. What do you mean, heretics? Geth build our own future. The heretics ask the old machines to give them the future. Mm. They are no longer part of us. See, we were studying the old machines hardware to protect our future. This is very interesting, and it's why it's actually colored the way I play the way I replay these games, definitely. Because initially, you're just like, oh, get they're the same. You really are. Like, I mean, you've seen nothing to, to, to differentiate. Like, you've killed thousands of Geth. You've destroyed thousands of Geth, and none of them are like this one. And you've never seen any semblance of, like, culture or anything from them. Of any, of a distinction between them, except for, you know, like, some of them are bigger than others. What future are the Geth building? Ours. Will anyone else be affected by whatever it is you're doing? If they involve themselves, they will. Are the Reapers a threat to you too? Yes. Why would they attack other machines? We are different from them, outside their plans. Mmm. You have perhaps progressed further than they anticipated. Okay. So you aren't allied with the Reapers? We oppose the heretics. We oppose the old machines. He's mimicking me. Shepard Commander opposes the old machines. Shepard Commander opposes the heretics. Cooperation furthers mutual goals. Oh. I can't, I did this one or this one, I can't remember. Are you asking to join us? Yes. Then what should I call you? Here we go. Geth. She's like, okay. I mean you, specifically. He's mimicking, we see? We are all What is the individual in front of me called? <laughs> there is no individual. We are Geth. There are currently 1,183 programs active within this platform. My name is Legion, for we are many. Why? No, that's fine. That seems appropriate. Christian Bible, the Gospel of Mark, chapter 5, verse 9. We acknowledge this is an appropriate Except metaphor. it's not because Legion is evil in the Bible. The of the Gath. We will integrate into Normandy. Huh? <laughs> we anticipate the exchange of data. <laughs> we anticipate the exchange of data. Uh, what else did it say? Okay. Shepard Commander. 
We have completed our analysis of the Reaper's data core. Did you find anything useful? We were sent to the old machine to preserve the Geth's future. We are prepared to reveal how. The heretics have developed a weapon to use against Geth. You would call it a virus. It is stored in the Ah, yes, okay, this is Legion's Sovereign. personal mission. Over time, the virus will change us. Make us conclude that worshipping the old machines is correct. So the virus would give all Geth the heretics logic. And all Geth would then go to war with organics. Yes, Geth believe all intelligent life should self-determinate. The heretics no longer share this belief. They judge that forcing an invalid conclusion on us is preferable to a continued schism. If it were released, how quickly would this virus spread through your people? We are networked via FTL comm buoys. Most would change within a day. Isolated platforms would remain unaffected until they rejoined the network. Mm hmm I thought Geth couldn't be hacked or get viruses, at least for more than a few seconds. Altered programs are restored from archives. New installations are deleted. This heretic weapon introduces a subtle operating error in our most basic runtimes. The equivalent of your nervous system. An equation with a result of 1.33382 returns as 1.33381. This changes the results of all higher processes. We will reach different conclusions. So the reason they worship the Reapers is a math error? It is difficult to express. Yes, it is. Your brain exists as chemistry, electricity. Like AIs, you are shaped by both hardware we are, and it, software. It's true. We are purely software, mathematics. The we are, we're shaped by biology. Our conclusion is valid for us. Neither result is an error. An analogy. Heretics say one is less than two. Geth say two is less than three. So why did you need to go to the Reaper corpse? The heretics store the code in a quantum storage device Sovereign provided. To find and destroy the virus, we needed to understand its code and data storage structures. Okie dokie. You know where this thing is? The Heretics Headquarters Station, on the edge of the Terminus. We will provide coordinates. Normandy's stealth systems are necessary to safely approach. They build stations in the Terminus? Where is this thing? Between stars. Organics have no cause to look there. Hmm. But why do they build stations outside Geth territory in the first place? The Heretics seek improvement from the old machines. In exchange, they help them attack organics. We condemn these judgments. Hmm. What's the plan once we get aboard? The Geth will disrupt their network, prevent the station's defenses from focusing on us. The Reaper data core is physically isolated from the network. We will need to be escorted to it to access and destroy the data. What defenses should we expect? In space, none. With them, mobile platforms of various configuration and non-sentient defense turrets. How many Geth? There may be billions of individual programs. Fortunately, most will be uploaded to the central computer. Only a few mobile platforms are maintained at any time. Others are manufactured when needed. Perfect. This could be our best chance to end the conflict between Organics and Geth. Let's do it. We will begin preparations. Okay. What, anything Shepard else? Commander, are you prepared to attack the Heretic Stronghold? Okay, bye. Not yet. Acknowledged. Okay, everybody good? Everybody good. All right, we good? Everybody good. How may I help you? I Commander? thought she said something. I'll see you later, Doctor. Commander. And I could have sworn. I, mean, I know there's got to be one, but I don't know exactly where. Maybe later. But I think I'm going to call this one here. Not sure how it's going to edit out, but we'll see. Um, anyway. Thank you guys for joining me. I appreciate it. I hope you're enjoying it. We're getting close to the end. Pretty close to the end of the game. So, uh, anyway. Thank you guys again for joining me. I'll see you in the next one.